Being able to repeat a command is quite useful because you will often find yourself doing the same thing multiple times. For example, let's say you just created a line segment and ended the command. Then you decide that you want to create another line segment. Although you could start the command again by going back to the ribbon and clicking on the line tool, this requires a lot of movement and extra clicks. Every time you go back and click on a button in the ribbon, you have to take your eyes off the drawing window and direct your attention back to the ribbon. And depending on the size of your display, this can require a lot of mouse movement. There ought to be an easier way to repeat the last command. And there are actually several different ways you can repeat a command. If you've ended the command and AutoCAD is waiting for you to select a new command, which you can see by the fact that in the command window, the command line simply displays the word command, you can simply press the space bar to repeat whatever command you used last. So in this case, since the last command I used was the line command, pressing the space bar repeats the line command. So AutoCAD prompts me to specify the first point. After you've finished drawing lines, pressing the space bar or the Enter key or the Escape key will end the command. And then again, pressing the space bar will restart the line command. You can also repeat the last command by pressing the Enter key, but most users find it easier to press the space bar because it's easier to locate the space bar on the keyboard without having to actually look down at the keyboard. Another way that I can repeat the command is to right-click to display a shortcut menu. Notice that the first item in the shortcut menu is the line command. This shortcut menu will always show the most recently used command on the first line of the menu. So you can repeat the command by choosing it in this shortcut menu. A third way to repeat a command is to move your cursor down into the command window and then right-click in the command window. When you right-click in the command window, AutoCAD displays a different shortcut menu. Notice that at the top of this menu is an item labeled Recent Commands. If you expand this selection, you can see a list of up to six recent commands with the most recent command, in this case, the line command, as the first item in the list. You can then repeat any one of these commands by selecting it in the flyout list. And here's one more tip. Not only will pressing the spacebar restart the last command, but if you press the spacebar another time, after starting the command, AutoCAD will jump back to the last point you specified. So in this case, pressing the spacebar once restarts the line command, and pressing it again uses the endpoint of the previous line segment as the starting point for the next line segment.